Brad Nessler here, and with me as always, Kirk Herbstreit and Lee Corso. The heat may be a factor in today's game with the Texas Tech Red Raiders and the Aggies of Texas A&M. We hope you're ready for an action-packed game of NCAA football. And here come the Aggies. The Aggies are coming into this game looking very fired up. Kirk, what are your thoughts on today's game? Texas Tech looks to unveil their high-powered offense. A guy to look out for is their wideout. Lee, I'll tell you what, this defense and this young secondary is going to have their hands full because I think they're a little overmatched. I picked my winner this morning. Here we go. The Red Raiders, sweetheart. That's who I'm picking. Number six, fields at the goal line. So now we'll get to see the offense come out of the field for their first drive of this game. Well, guys, how do you think this rushing attack is going to do against this defense today? I know that this offense has a wonderful running back, but not so fast, my friends. I think this defense is going to win the battle today, led by a superstar linebacker. Yeah, this linebacker should have a big impact on this game. If he plays well, then the defense will hold up. But if he plays bad, then we may be in for a long day. They line up at the 21. It's second down. The Aggies come out in a shotgun. Looks to pass. He lets it go, catches it, and they make the stop at the 27 yard line. That was a good completion there. Yeah, I really like the good clean routes they ran on that play. Third down, four yards to go on the 27 yard line. Number seven comes to the line with three wide. The Aggies the line up the front. Yard line. Number 44 the awaits the snap. The Number 44 the punts it, and this is a wonderful kick. Number 20 takes it at the 33. Now we'll get to see how this quarterback can do today as he comes out of the field for the first time. They'll take over at the 37 yard line. First Number 13 lines up in the shotgun. Drop back to pass. Number 13 delivers. And it's caught. Breaks one. Good pickup on that pass play to the fullback. Look at the soft hands in that big fellow. Go to him again. First person ten. ten. Ball on the 48-yard line. Texas Tech comes out in the shotgun. He drops back. He's rolling right. He passes it. That's a great tackle. Down the 41. The wideout made a good-looking grab there. You're right. And the quarterback threw it as soon as he saw he had that extra step. First, First down. Ball on the 41-yard line. Texas Tech sets up with four receivers. He looks to throw on first down. Got it to the senior. 
Tackle made at the 27-yard line. Fellas, this is really turning into a very impressive drive. Three first downs and counting on this drive, Kirk. Yeah, they've done a good job of building some momentum here, and more importantly, they've kept this defense on the field. First, first down, down, 10 to go. Ball on the 27. Drops back on first down. Slips it short. It's complete. He's taken down at the 12. The defense just didn't match up well on that play. Yeah, it's man-to-man -man defense, and it looked like the receiver just beat the cover man for the first down. First, first and 10. They're threatening inside the 20. The Aggies bring in the nickel package. They'll throw on first down, and they try to set up a screen. A four-yard loss. Second down and 14. Texas Tech lines up in a shotgun set. Number 13 guns it right side. And he's taken down Number at the 14 yard line. The and they pick up two Game yards. Two on the play. They line up at the 14. Third down and 12 to go. The Aggies line up with six defensive backs. Defense looking for his first incompletion this drive. Wants to throw outside. Great effort here by the wideout. You know what? The quarterback on the ball just enough to cause the incompletion. So the kicking team is on the field. They'll try for three. This one is from 31 yards out. Trying to take the lead by a field goal. The kick is up, and the field goal is good. And now we'll take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. Texas Tech lines up for the kickoff. Number 48 and number 6 back deep to return. Kicks it away. Number 48 fields it in the end zone. So the offense takes over. The last time they had the ball, they had no time getting anything going. They'll take over at the 21. will start the drive at the 21-yard line. First and 10. One man backfield. They'll throw on first down. He throws it. Someone got a hand on it. Well, he tried to thread the needle with that pass. Well, here the quarterback makes a poor decision, throwing into coverage. Needs to look at his progression and find the second and third receiver. Second, it's second and down and 10 to go. Ball on the 21. Texas A&M comes out in the shotgun. Little handoff. They'll bring him down at the 23. The running back gets two on the carry. Two on the play. Third and eight. Ball on the 23 yard line. The Aggies line up with four wideouts. Back to pass. Moves up in the pocket. Looks. And he's going to be sacked for a loss. And they got him with a blitz. And that time the pressure came from the safety position. Nobody picked him up, and he came up with a big time play. Fourth and 
14. The Aggies line up the punt. Yeah. Number 20, the return man. In the punt. Number 20, back deep to return. Punts the ball away. Number 20, fields at the 44. He just got shut down on the punt return. Yeah, in situations like that, Brad, it's probably best if you just call for a fair catch. This drive will start at the 48. The Red Raiders with four receivers. Looks to pass. He fires. Has it to the senior. To the 20. To the 10. Touchdown, Texas Tech. The wide receiver flew down the field on that touchdown connection. But well, he has the speed to stretch the defense, and his hands are getting better every single game. There's a flag down, and here's the call. And sports like conduct on the offense. The three yard point will be forced on the turn. Now they'll try to tack on the extra point. And he converts the extra point. Under a minute now in the first quarter and the score. Texas Tech 10, Texas A&M nothing. Texas Tech, Tech is ready to kick it away. Football. He kicks it off. Number 48 fields it at the one. And now we'll see the offense coming out of the field for their next position. They'll go to work at the 22-yard line. First and 10. Texas A&M lines up with three receivers. It goes straight to the back. He jukes him. He's taken down at the 23. And he gets a yard on the run. One yard gain on the play. Second it's second down and nine to go. Ball on the 23. 23 yard line. Number seven is back in the gun. Tackle at the 31. A draw play to the running back gives him eight or nine eight yards. Eight on the play. And we've come to the end of the first quarter with the score. Texas Tech 10. Texas A&M nothing. Third and one. Third down and one. On the 31 yard line. Number 25 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. And he stopped behind the line. One yard loss for the halfback. One yard loss on the play. Fourth and two. The Aggies Ball line up the to the yard line. Number 20 will be the return man. Number 20, back deep to return. He punts it. Number 20 fields at the 31. They moved the ball very effectively on their last drive, which ended with a touchdown. The defense has been talking over on the sideline, trying to make some corrections. Let's see if they can stop them this time. The offense will start at the 33. Start the drive at the 33 yard line. First and 10. Texas Tech lines up in a shotgun set. He drops back. He tosses it short. Incomplete pass. Oh, man. Truck passes just aren't acceptable. I don't care if you're getting hit or not. Hey. 
He'll shake it off. No big deal. Watch. They'll go to him again, and he'll come up with the catch. You know, he probably will, but there's still no excuse for the one he just dropped. Second, second down and 10, and 10 to go. All, all on the 33 yard line. The Red Raiders come out showing three wide. He's looking to pass. He's looking for his man. And it's the senior. At the 40. To the 20. To the 10. And he gets the touchdown. They hooked up for the big play. The coaches do a good job of getting this receiver the ball. They design plays specifically for him, like the one we just saw. And the end results are huge chunks of yardage and touchdowns. They'll line it up for the extra point. And he hits the PAT. Over four minutes remain in the second quarter, and our score is Texas Tech, 17. Texas A&M, nothing. Texas Tech lines Texas up for the kickoff. Number 48, 48 and number six deep to return. Number 48 from his own end zone. Not a whole lot of success their last time out. Not at all. This offense has to do a better job of staying on the field and giving their defense a chance to catch their breath. They'll set up the shot at the 20 yard line. First and 10. And they have three bunch. Drops back to pass. The senior makes the catch. And down he goes at the 39. How about that pass, fellas? Well, Brad, the defense was coming with the blitz, and that opened some room for these guys to get open. Yeah, and if you're coming with the blitz, you better get to this quarterback. Otherwise, he'll make you pay. Here's the offensive production statistics, sponsored by Coca-Cola. Number seven with three wide receivers. He looks to throw on first down. He looks, and he's going to be sacked for a loss. Makes the sack. Loss of six on the play. Second down. Ball, Ball on the 33-yard line. Texas Tech lines up with five defensive backs. Intercepted. Not a good time for an interception, fellas. Now, Brad, you're exactly right. Your team's already down a few scores, and you throw a pick, and this could be. And it's going to be a long day for these guys if they don't pick it up real soon. I mean real soon. The and they'll look to capitalize on a good field position here. First and ten. Once and all, intercepted in the end zone. What a catch. I'm surprised he was able to hang on to that one. People tend to think that guys play corner if their hands aren't good enough to play wide receiver. As we just saw, that's not always the case. Sometimes it's actually the opposite. Some guys play receiver instead of corner because they don't want to hit or tackle anybody. They'll this drive will start at the 20-yard 20 20 line. line. First and 10. The Aggies line up with a single setback to Tackle made at the 23-yard line. Number 25 one, gets three yards on the play. On the play. So that'll make it second down. They second line up at the 23. Ball on second the and seven coming up here. Line. Going with the shotgun here. Play action. He's brought 
down. At the 18 yard line, makes the sack. Five yard loss on the play. Third and 12. 12 yards to go. On the 18 yard line. They'll line up with five wide receivers. He drops back. Rifles it right. Incomplete. The gunslinger couldn't hit his receiver on that pass. I wonder why. Could it have been because it was going in the next county? Fourth and 12. The Aggies are lining up the front and away. Number 44 is waiting for the snap. Number 20, back deep to return. He gets it away. Number 20, field kick to 41. The offense with a lot of success through the air on that last drive as they moved it down the field for the touchdown. They'll start this drive at midfield. We'll start the drive. Six at DBs the in the line. First and ten. Fakes to the back. He gets the pass away. Picked off. He's tackled at the 48-yard line. The defense now has two interceptions in the game. And what a nice interception that was. I think there was a miscommunication there on the offensive side of the ball. I think maybe the receiver ran the wrong route. But regardless, still great play by the defense. They'll this is a great drive, place to start the, the drive on the line. opponent's side First of the 15. Number 25 is the single setback. What? Gives it up the gut. What a collision. Instead of running around the defenders, he ran right the into them. I don't think it mattered if he ran left or right or over the top. They just lost a battle up front. Second it's second down 13. now and 13 to go. Ball on the 49-yard line. to the right. They went with exhaust, but the defense was all over it. Man, were they flying to the football or what? That's how defense is supposed to be played. Third and third down. Ball on the 47-yard line. The defense is looking for the pass as they bring out their dime package. It's deflected. Number 14 was the intended receiver on the play. And they're going to have to bring on the punt team. Fourth and 15. Texas A&M lining up the punt. Number 44 awaits the snap. Plenty of hang time on this one. Calls for the fair catch. Let's see if this defense has trouble defending the pass again the here. If they do, my friend, look out. They're going to give up another touchdown in a hurry. The They'll Texas start Tech at Red the 19-yard line. Take over at the 19-yard line. First and 10. From the gun. Back to pass. And they make the stop at the 27-yard line. I'll tell you, this receiver showed really good hands on that play. This kid is always calling for the ball. And if he keeps making plays like that, he'll continue to get the ball. Second and two, Second and two coming up here. Ball on the 27-yard line. Number 39, alone in the backfield. Setting up the play action. He passes it. Caught. Way to look it in. Nice kick. Sure was. He just played some great hands there. Now we're looking at a first down. First first down. Ball on the 31 yard line. Number 13 comes to the line with three wide. With a quick throw. He's taken down at the 35. Texas Tech will call a timeout, and they'll have one timeout left. It's second down, six yards to go. Ball on their own 35. 
Number 39, the lone back. Across the middle. And that one's incomplete. And number 39 was the intended receiver on that pass. And that'll make it third down. Third and their own, 35-yard line. All on the We've got a third and six. The Red Raiders come out in the shotgun. He's looking to pass. Surveys the field. And he's hammered as he lets it go. Tackle at the 44-yard line. What did you see there, guys? The defense was in zone coverage. The offense did a good job of protecting the quarterback, and he threw a nice ball to get the first down. And the receiver ran a nice route to get open through the zone coverage. Gets the ball. No, they faked it. And it's intercepted. A well-timed interception there. Well, they're still down by a couple of scores, but the turnover certainly helps their chances. If they score on this drive, they're right back in the game. They'll get the ball here up at the 39-yard line. First and 10. Texas A&M comes out in the shotgun. He drops back. Number seven. Unloads. In the air. It's intercepted. It looks like he's just baiting that quarterback into throwing his way. Yeah, you're exactly right. He's getting the quarterback all messed up with his reads. That's great individual effort by that player. They'll, They'll start, start to work the at the 48 yard line. First and 10. The Red Raiders are lining up with three receivers. And it's caught. Brought down at the 35 yard line. And guys, he's already over 200 yards passing in the first half. Well, he's off to a great start. It'll be interesting to see if he can maintain this level of play for the rest of the game. They'll bring in their dime pack. He unloads it. It's complete, and they make the stop at the 29-yard line. He ran a good route there and was able to pick up yards underneath the coverage. It's okay to move the ball in small portions because it relaxes the offense and can open things up for the big play. The Red Raiders line up with a single set back to you. Way to look it in. It's complete there for about five yards. And the first down. This won't look like much on the stat sheet, but this play was executed to perfection. The Red Raiders are going to take a timeout, and that was their third and final timeout. So with the half ending, they're just going to try to put three points up on the board. He gets it up, and it is good. Not a bad kick to get your team three points, Kirk. Yeah, he got some good leg behind it, and he kicked an accurate ball right between the goalposts. They line up to kick this one away. Kicks it away. Number six from his own end zone. He shoots. And that'll do it for the first half of play. Our halftime score, Texas Tech 20, Texas A&M nothing. Texas A&M to the kick, up for the number 39, ball. and number, number 20 back to return. He kicks it off. Number 20 takes it from the six. And now a slight break in the action as the offense comes out on the field for their next possession. The 
the offense will take over and will start the drive at the 24-yard line. First and 10. Texas Tech lines up in a shotgun set. Setting up the play action. He chucks it downfield. Got it. At the 40. At the 30. To the 20. To the 10. He's all the way. Touchdown. Another touchdown pass. That is number three. You know what? It takes a lot of courage to play quarterback at the college level. And with that touchdown pass, this kid's showing how courageous and confident he really is. They line up for the extra point. He splits the uprights for the extra point. So with under five minutes left in the third quarter, our score, Texas Tech, 27, Texas A&M, nothing. Number 30 looks ready to kick this one off. Kicks it off. Number 48. Number 6 fields it at the 3. Breaks one. Time once again for this offense to come back out and start another drive. Number 6 on the return. I've seen plays like this where the tailback breaks one and goes for a touchdown. You're right, Lee. You can never tell. They seven line up at the 17. Long. We've got a second and long. Yeah. One man backfield. He's looking to pass. He's going right. Got it to him on the run. And down Number he goes three. at the 29-yard line. A nice completion to the tight end. A good play here, and the thing that I notice is that he provides a nice big target out there for the quarterback. Third, it's third down. Ball on the 29-yard line. Texas A&M comes to the line with three wide. him down for a loss. Two yard loss. Loss of two on the play. Fourth and six. The punt team is on the field looking to kick this one away. Number 44 is waiting for the snap. He gets it off. Number 20 back to return. Number 20 takes it to the 33. Great pass to the key in the offense the last time they had the ball. Secure. They were able to pick apart the defense and get down the field for a touchdown. So if I'm the coach, I'm telling my defensive lineman to get more pressure on that quarterback, please. The first, first down, 10, ten yards to go. Take over. Ball in the own First and ten. ten. The Red Raiders Ooh. set up in the gun. Ah. Drops back to pass. Number 13 lets it go. Complete, and they make the stop at the 44-yard line. I know I've said this all week, but I like this kid's arm. On the He's got good mechanics and a nice touch on the ball. He's not doing bad in this game either, my friend. Not bad is right, Lee. That last pass gives him over 300 yards on the day. First, first and 10. Ball on the 44-yard line. Number 13 is back in the gun. Hut. 
They'll bring him down at the 43 yard line. Number 39, number 39 picks up a yard on the play. That will make it second down. Second it's second down and nine to go. Ball on the 43 yard line. Number 13 lines up with four wideouts. He drops back, steps up, looking. Number 13 lets it fly. Sheds one tackler. Tackle made at the 29 yard line. What do you think of that catch, coach? This game's got its highs and lows, but one of the highs has got to be the play of this kid. He could play for my team any day. First We've got a first and ten. Ball, ball, ball on the 29 yard line. line. They'll work from the shotgun. Cut. There's the play fake. And he's going to come up with a sack. Second down. Number 13 with four wide receivers. Pass with the throw. It's deflected. That ball Number should have been kicked off. This quarterback had too much play. faith in his arm that time. Well, that confidence almost led to a change of possession. His man wasn't even close to being open. Right. Third and long. They come out with three wide ball receivers. 36 yard line. He drops back. Steps up. He's looking. Number 13. Rifles at left. He gets another, and this is a big one. And they're building some great momentum on this drive. Guys. That's right, Brad. That was a crisp pass by the quarterback, and they're looking pretty good moving the ball right now. First, First and 10. ten. They're inside the 20. One man backfield. On play action. Throws. He came down with it. Touchdown. A great throw. And that's his second touchdown catch of the game. The quarterback knew exactly where to put the pass. And the receiver went out there and made the grab. Good communication there. They'll line up for the extra point. And he adds the extra point. So with less than two to go in the third quarter, our score, Texas Tech 34, Texas A&M nothing. Everyone's all lined up and Texas ready for the kickoff. Kicks kick it away. Number 48 back deep to return. Number 48 fields it at the two. The defense really shut these guys down the last time they had the ball. The offense looked a bit out of sync on that last possession, Coach. And it was the defense that threw them out of sync, Kirk. Those guys are fired up. Let's see if they can hold them again. It's first down. The 20-yard line. First and 10. The defense is playing the pass on this one. Moves up in the pocket. And he takes a big hit at the 18-yard line. With the tackle. Loss of two on the play. Second From their own 18-yard line. Ball on the 18 Second yard down. Line. They'll work from the shotgun. Cut. On the delay. And he's taken down at the 19-yard line. Back to the line of scrimmage. Maybe a yard on the delay to the fullback. Third and 11. Ball on the 19-yard line. 19-yard line. Number seven has five receivers lined up here. 
He zips it, and he pulls it down. Tackle at the 33. Talk about a throw. Does this kid have an arm or what? I'm telling you, this thing is like a laser beam coming out of his hand. Boy, you're right. What a cannon this young man's got. First and ten. Ball on their own 33. Number seven with three wide receivers. They'll throw on first down. Let's it go. Got it to his receiver. And he's all the way down to the 40. And that play could have gone for six. Oh, boy, you're right. And all week long, this secondary did a lot of talking about how they were going to dominate these receivers. I think this is time that they step up and prove it on the field. Forget about talking trash. Let's see how they react after giving up that big play. First they line up at the 40. Ball on the first down. Yard line. Number 25 lines up as a single back. He got hit hard. Oh, it looked back. like the defense knew exactly what play was called. Great instinct there on that run play. Unless we see some sort of miracle, this one's pretty much over. Heading to the fort. Our score, Texas Tech 34, Texas A&M nothing. Second it's second and 15. 15. Ball, Ball of the 45. 45-yard line. The Aggies have three receivers bunched. Throw. They'll bring him down at the 32-yard line. Team. Good the job to avoid the rush and get the pass off. Well, when you try to get to the quarterback with the blitz, you better have some talented corners because they could end up on an island out there all alone. Let's take a look at the offensive production numbers brought to you by Coca-Cola. Texas A&M will line up in a jumbo set here. Fakes to the back. Down the middle. Again, it's complete. Touchdown, Aggie. How do they let the tight end get so open on such a big play? It was poor defense. It looks like there was some miscommunication between the safety and the linebackers, which caused for him to get so open. Here's the try for the extra point. And he converts the extra point. And with just over four minutes remaining in the fourth quarter, the score is Texas Tech 34, Texas A&M 7. Texas a and lined up for the onside kick. Here's the onside. That'll Texas be enough to put this one away. Yeah, but give them kick. credit. They played hard today. They just didn't catch the lucky breaks they needed. They'll Excellent field position to start the drive. First and ten. Red one man backfield. He drives back, stepping up, throws to the middle, complete, what a catch. Number four, That's a first down right defense. there. Yeah, if I was Game a defense, I think I would man up on these guys next time. Yeah, this quarterback is very good at recognizing zone coverage and then finding the open receiver. First it's first ten. and ten, ball, ball on the 32-yard line. line. Number seven, back in the gun, drops back on first down. And he's tackled at the 17-yard line. What, what happened there, guys? Well, they were in man-to-man -man coverage on that play, and I couldn't tell if the defender slipped or if he just got beat on that play. No, he just got beat. It was a good catch for the first down. Have a look at our Old Spice red zone numbers. Red zone, when performance matters most. The last time they were in the red zone, they got a touchdown out of it. Looks to pass. Down the middle. Another catch. And it pays off. Touchdown. Nice.
nice play call on that one to get the ball in the receiver's hands. Yeah, and a quarterback says, you want the ball, go get it. And did he ever. He got it and took it for six. So the kicker lines up for the PAT. And he tacks on the extra point. So with less than four minutes to go here in the fourth quarter, our score, Texas Tech 41, Texas A&M 7. Ready to kick this one off. He sends it off. Number 48 builds it at the 2. At the 30. At the 40. Across midfield. Down the sideline. To the 20. To the 10. They return it all the way for the touchdown. Guys, what do you think about that one? I'll tell you what. This kid is a real playmaker. You know what, Lee? Sheer determination displayed right there. He set his sights on the end zone and would not be denied. So the kicker's on the field to attempt the extra point. And he converts the extra point. So with less than four minutes to go here in the fourth quarter, our score, Texas Tech, 41, Texas A&M, 14. Texas A&M is lining up for the onside kick here. Here goes nothing. Well, that'll end all hopes the of miracle. Kick. You can say that again. This one is pretty much done. Right. They'll we'll see if they can capitalize the on the good field position. Ten. Three, Number seven three, lines up in the four. shotgun. He decides to run with it. He's taken Number down at the 39-yard line. Gain of two on the play. From the 39-yard line. Ball on the 39-yard line. The Red Raiders line up in a goal line formation. What great play recognition by this linebacker. He saw the run was coming, and he just shot through the third gap and made a great tackle. Ball on the they line up at the 40. It's third down and nine to go. Hut. Back to pass. Looking. Throws it to the outside. Finds his receiver. And he's all the way down to the 12-yard line. That was a pretty impressive play. Yep, but we've seen this all game long, Kirk. There's still no excuse for this defense to just shut down. I mean, you'd think that they'd work a little bit harder to stop the offense when they're losing this bad. And since we're in the red zone, let's have a look at the numbers. Brought to you by Old Spice Red Zone when performance matters most. The Aggies line up in a nickelback. And they get the sack. We've got a second and long. The Red Raiders come to the line with their jumbo package. Pullback, handoff. And he just got thrilled. He plows ahead for a two-yard. 
our game. Number two on the play. This defense faces another third down. Nickel defense. At the four, Texas A&M will take their first time out of the half. It's fourth down. They'll line this up, and it'll be about a 21-yard or two. This is to add to an already impressive lead. The kick is up, and it's through the uprights. And now we're going to take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. Number 48 is back ready to receive, and boy, has he been the game breaker on special teams today. Number 48 from his own end zone. They've been getting blocked all day, but at least they're still working hard. I like a team that never quits. Let's take a look at the offensive production numbers, brought to you by Coke. The Aggies have three receivers bunched. He looks to throw on first down. He throws it, and it's caught, and he's tackled at the 24. Texas A&M takes a timeout. And it looks like we've got our Coca-Cola players of the game. Very well played game by these gentlemen. They'll work from the shotgun. He's gobbled up in the Number back. Eight, on the tackle, loss of four on the play. Third got third and ten. Ball on the 20-yard line. Texas A&M comes to the line. Only one man in the backfield. Across the middle. In replays and no first down, and now it's decision time for this offense. Well, the defense did what they had to do so far. They're showing a lot of heart out there. Fourth and ten. The Aggies Ball line up the punt. Number 20 is back to receive. Back to punt. Number 20, back to return. Punts the ball away. Fields it at the 38. Three points was the result of their last drive as the offense heads out for another. They'll start the drive at the 40 yard line. First and 10. And this should be a kneel down as they just try to kill the clock. And he takes a knee. We've got a second and 11. Ball on the 39-yard line. And this ball game's over. Any final thoughts on this one, Coach? I can't say enough about this performance. Texas Tech looked like a team on a mission to destroy anything and everything that got in their way. Brad, this is a really good-looking football team. Thanks for joining us for another presentation of NCAA Football 2007. And our final score in this one, Texas Tech 44, Texas A&M 14. A special Thank thanks goes out to everyone at EA Sports. It's been a pleasure bringing you this game.